me and Offset, we was not seeing eye to eye. This was like the same year that I filed for divorce and everything. It seems like Cardi's mom is done with Offset's cheating once and for all now. Cardi B has been more than forgiving for Offset's cheating habits, but things are getting a little out of hand as he's allegedly sleeping with women every other day. So now, Cardi's mom has decided to put a stop to it. Cardi B has filed for divorce from Offset twice over the years, but she called it off the first time probably because of cold feet. But fans think she didn't sign a prenup and doesn't want to lose millions of dollars, so she's tolerating Offset. She has once again filed for divorce and reports have surfaced that she's pregnant with her third child now, so she might be rethinking her decision again. Cardi B just announced that she is expecting another baby right after filing for divorce from her husband, Offset. Earlier today, TMZ reported that Cardi B has filed for divorce from Offset. They report that this has nothing to do with cheating and that the divorce was a long time coming. So things started going wrong between Cardi B and Offset in 2017 when Offset was first accused of cheating on Cardi B. A video of him got leaked where he could be seen with a naked woman in a hotel. The Migos rapper started making excuses and said that his iCloud was hacked. Only days after this video was leaked, a model, Celine Powell, gave a statement that she's pregnant with Offset's child. Initially, Cardi B denied the rumors and didn't leave Offset, but people kept questioning her about it so she finally lashed out. Why is it a problem that I want to take my time with a decision on my relationship? Why do I have to explain myself? I don't ask you why you still with that man that lives with his mom, that don't pay your bills. Since when you guys have a perfect relationship? So for a while, people stopped pestering Cardi about Offset because it seemed like she doesn't really care if he cheats on her. But once again, Cardi decided to talk about the situation saying, It's like everybody is coming down my neck like, Why are you not leaving him? You have low self-esteem. I don't have low self-esteem. I know I look good. She also added, I know I'm rich, I know I'm talented. I know I could get any man I want, any basketball player, football player. But I want to work out by shit with my man and I don't got to explain why I'm not your property. This is my life. I'm going to take my time and I'm going to decide on my decision. It's not right what he did, but people don't know what I did, cause I ain't no angel. This statement concerned Cardi B fans because Cardi was basically throwing herself under the bus just to justify the cheating off Offset which was alarming to say the least. But in 2018, when Cardi B got pregnant, shit really hit the fan. Cause you will fucking talk to a nigga and a motherfucker will play in your fucking face, in your fucking face, over and over and over and over and over again. And she'll be like, watch, watch what I'm about to do. Watch what I'm about to say. And it's so fucking sad that a nigga like to, yo, this motherfucker really likes to play games with me when I'm at my most vulnerable. People started commenting on Offset's extramarital affairs and how he's sleeping with a different woman every day while Cardi B is pregnant with his kid. But it seemed like things were going okay between Cardi B and Offset, and she even said it in an interview that she didn't trust him for the longest time because of the people around her. For a long time we was in love with each other, but we didn't really trust in each other. It was like a competition of who's gonna hit each other up first. I don't want to hit him up first, he will hit me up first. People used to put things in my head, he's gonna leave you. He be fucking with mad bitches. Now people think that the person who was warning Cardi B about offset cheating and sleeping around was her mom. Cardi B portrayed her as if she was trying to manipulate. But in reality, she was probably saving Cardi from the hurt she was about to experience. Even after being cheated several times, Cardi B somehow found a way to justify Offset's actions, and one way or the other, they remained together. Insiders believe that Cardi B's mother was against their relationship from the very beginning because she thought that Offset was too loose in his ways and he's not serious about Cardi B. But when he got down on his knees and proposed to Cardi B during a concert, her heart obviously melted and she said yes. Everything after that has been an absolute train wreck because their marriage has basically crashed and burned repeatedly over the years. Cardi B has also revealed that she depends a lot on her mother for taking care of her kids. She also said that she doesn't want to put too much pressure on her parents, but they're all the help she's got. It seems like Offset isn't a very hands-on parent and Cardi B has to figure everything out on her own. In this situation, it's fair for Cardi B's mother to be bitter towards Offset and advise her not to give him another chance. Insiders are reporting that after their recent rift,
Cardi B's mother has made it clear that she doesn't want her to be with Offset anymore. It's definitely bad for Cardi B and kids' mental health, and it's also bad PR. What relationship advice can I share is that if you love somebody, no matter what, try to work it out. Mm. There's no way Cardi isn't gonna look desperate after giving dozens of chances to a cheating man. And that's the last thing Cardi's mom wants. She has advised her to stay away from Offset and be civil while they co-parent their children. On the other hand, Offset has also addressed his cheating rumors in the past, and even though they aren't convincing, let's hear what he has to say. I feel like people dive into the negativity. Also, I feel like there be like a hate train of people that don't like my wife. And she does everything else to the T, so that's the only thing you can attack. We all humans but at the end of the day, it does affect home. It's actually surprising how Offset is trying to talk about Cardi B and the hate she receives instead of addressing the fact that he has cheated on her repeatedly and she gets the hate for still not leaving him. But finally, Cardi B has decided to leave Offset and has reportedly filed for divorce. She's also seeking primary custody of both her kids, culture, and wave. Cardi B has filed for divorce in the past too, and she still took Offset back so it's still unclear if she's gonna do that again. According to page six, Cardi filed for divorce saying the two have just grown apart. But wait, Cardi announced she's pregnant. She posted a picture showing off her baby bump in her fur coat during a heat wave in New York City. This is Cardi and Offset's third child and their second time filing for divorce. It's also the 328th time they've broken up. But judging by how many times Offset has cheated on her, chances of her mom letting her go back to him are very thin. She's an adult and makes her own decisions, but Cardi B's mother is not happy at all with how he treats her and that's why she reportedly wants Cardi B to get a divorce and full custody of the kids. It won't be long until Offset pulls some elaborate stunt and apologizes during one of her concerts, in front of the world. But that doesn't change the fact that he hasn't just disappointed Cardi B, but her entire family by cheating repeatedly and feeling no remorse. So do you think Cardi B would like to go back to Offset? Drop a comment and let us know. Also, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates. We'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care and thanks for watching.